Hey guys, it's me Nina, and I'm here with a package from The Real Real. It's my first time ordering from them, and I've been waiting so long, and I would not be filming like this right now, but I am just so excited, and I have to leave in really like 10, 20 minutes for a class pass class, and I don't want to wait till I come home. When I come home, it's going to be dark. So I figured, you know what? It's supposed to come yesterday and I had the camera set up, everything ready. I was so ready to do unboxing, but it's here now. And it came in like a very unusual box. This is my first time buying a luxury consignment item. I used to want a Burberry coat. I guess I still want a Burberry, um, Burberry coat. Burberry trench coat because they say it's like a classic item, but it's what, like 1,700 new? And it's maybe 700 for a polyester blend, which seems very ridiculous to me. But when I decided to dress more ethically, I realized I could probably buy a used one for not a crazy cost. So this one I got for $200 with shipping, and I don't even know if it's gonna fit me, if I need to send it back or whatnot, but I wanted to do an unboxing video to show you what this is like. I tried to buy, buy a Zara trench instead used, and went on Poshmark and the seller canceled it, and I just took it as an omen to go for the one that I had initially wanted. And I still don't know how I feel about buying luxury items, even if they are used. So technically, like, it's more ethical because we're giving a second life to items. But I still don't know how I feel about it, but now I have one. So um, comment down below. Like, especially as a Christian and someone who's always trying to, like, best steward your resources, it just seems, like, kind of ridiculous to even want to own one. But I don't, like, is there really anything wrong with it? I don't know. And I love watching these types of videos, so excited. Um, okay, it says, the real real. I don't know if they purposely package it in literally the most disgusting box. I'm used to ordering from like nicer companies and getting nicer boxes, but it is a thrift shop essentially, so. Okay, um, so I also asked for this kit that explains how to um, sell your own luxury items as well. So let's just say like, I wanna eventually sell this. I get tired of it over time. I don't even know if this is going to fit me. I tried on a Burberry coat at Nordstrom and I was a size 4. So I got a size 4 for this, but I don't know. That could have just been like that particular coat. And this is definitely older. So, and it comes in this bag. It says the real, real. It's a weird that I'm like smelling it. It smells old. Wow, this is really gorgeous. Wow, this is really gorgeous. So, this is what the item looks like. Oh my gosh, I'm getting like goosebumps. This is like how weird I am. But it looks like really pretty. And there was like a mark towards the bottom of it, which is why I was like skeptical. Wow, I was actually like, I really wanted this. It says, an expert behind every item. This item cannot be returned once the tag is removed. So I won't take that off I'm gonna try it on yeah I mean it's a little tight to be honest and I am like smallest to my top I think I literally like because of how tight it is I probably would need to not be wearing like a heavy sweater or whatever underneath it but the fit is gorgeous and I love it more than I thought I would this is incredible this is you know 200 but this is like literally freaking out I'm so happy and when you think about it like this is a used item but it looks amazing I don't know if it's just because like someone treated it really well but yeah I love this this is gorgeous um, yeah so I had a really good experience with buying used I guess now uh, maybe I should do like a lookbook with this or something but I even like this I haven't even seen myself in a mirror let me do that wow the coat is gorgeous yeah, I am, I'm ecstatic. I'm really happy. And I'm like so happy that I decided to dress more ethically and even considered buying used because back in the day when I was just dressing like whatever way, I kind of thought I can't afford it, whatever else, never have it. But this is beautiful. Like this is amazing quality. Um, I know it's used, but like, I don't really care. Um, yeah, I'm, I always do this, I'm like, I'm really happy. <laughs> I know people say that material things don't make you happy, but this material good right now is making me pretty happy and a little sweaty, but I mean, 
it is a warm, you know, and it is like pretty tight fitting. That's the only other, only other thing. But I'm happy. I'm a happy camp camper. I don't even, <laughs> I'm really hot now. But yeah, so overall, my first experience buying with the real real, but this looks really gorgeous. The cotton is really thick. I feel like over time, as I've been trying to dress better and just buy better quality products and invest more and things like that, I can really tell when I buy something that's cheap now. And like, this is not cheap. I mean, even used, it's what? Like it cost me like $200. So looking at this, I'm just like, man, like it feels like really, thick cotton and it feels like really well made and I have my my gym clothes underneath granted I haven't gone to the gym yet yeah this is gorgeous the inside feels amazing this is really gorgeous and let's say like I it feels a little bit tight I could wear it like this like a lot of people don't wear their trench coats fully closed and I love this detail over here I'll do a few clips where you can see the inside. Really glad that I bought this. Made in Italy. Okay. Well, that's it. It does smell old, if that makes any sense. Oh, even buttons. It does smell old, but it's really nice. I'm really happy. That's it. Okay. And the other coat I considered buying was an Everlane one, which was around 158. Yeah. But yeah, I gotta get going. I need to head out now to my gym class and not be late. So I'm gonna leave, but this is really gorgeous. And I'll insert close-ups of it so you can get a better idea of what it looks like. But I've I had a good experience so far, you know, with the real real. And yeah, the box was sketchy, but I like the coat and it's what's inside that counts, right? I don't know if that goes along with this, but yeah. I don't, I'm just so weird. I'm just like, I don't know why I do this. I'm like, I'm happy. I'm whatever. Um, let me know your thoughts down below. What do you think of used items? What do you think of buying luxury items? What do you think of ethical fashion? You know, let's start a conversation in the comments. Um, my mom was so excited when she heard I was buying a Burberry trench coat. And then I said used. And she literally, like, all of the joy, all of the excitement just went away from her she was not happy at all so there is a huge stigma with buying an item that is used but i want to hear your thoughts do you think it's okay do you think it's not okay i mean i personally like i don't feel weird about it anymore but i've slowly done it more initially i did feel really weird about it so let me know your thoughts and i'm sorry i apologize for not being i would love to have been like super cute for this but i didn't want to wait and i feel like First reactions are always the most genuine. So yeah, let me go not be late.